Hey, hey, Blue Table fans! Today we are going to take a look at this really cool Seraphon army. You have seen it step, not step by step, but you've seen a few videos on it as we have gone along uh, creating this wonderful, amazing thing that someone is going to have a lot of fun with on the tabletop. So, first off, this is a, let's go ahead and just dive right in. There we go. It's a Skink Star Priest. This is the new uh, plastic kit that's out. Definitely an auto included in any Seraphon army. A converted Astrolith Bearer. These are pieces from the now out of print Tomb Kings range. And so we just kind of cut everything and put it together in a different way. Um, <clears throat> Little splashes of purple, I think, really offset the prominent orange that's in the army. In fact, let's go ahead and pan back. You definitely, you definitely feel the orange in this army. And we tried to make it a very uh, bright yet organic uh, color. So let's go ahead and look at the best stilodon. That's where it's most prominent. There's actually five or more different layers of color on the orange plates there. And then, of course, the Carnosaur. And a little Poison Dart Frog patterns on there. Again, splashes of, um, of purple, I think, really bring it out. Now, these are Temple Guard. I recommend using Temple Guard instead of uh, Saurus Warriors. If I were doing Seraphon, I would not have any Saurus Warriors in my army. I would just have Temple Guard. They're really great in the game and the models are definitely about a zillion times better. Here's some more skinks with blow darts, blow pipes or whatever. And the Seraphon, I was just reading their book again today and they are just really, really, really this super cool race. They have a great idea about them. The Slon actually summoned them. They're not real anymore. They're just summoned from magic stuff. From Azir which I think is the realm of the heavens or whatever in Age of Sigmar. Uh, so, you know, if you're gonna use bright colors, you gotta have a lot of very, uh, very neutral colors, gray being one of them, to sort of, you know, offset those. And I think that's done very well in this army. In fact, I like everything about this army. I think it's done really well. And we are definitely on standby to do your Age of Sigmar project. Would absolutely love to do it. I'm definitely well read up on the books now. And there you go. So I hope you have enjoyed and got your inspiration for the day.